Your Driver Information Center, or DIC, is located in the center of the instrument panel. The controls for the DIC are labeled Vehicle Info and are located under the Climate Control buttons. The DIC displays trip, fuel, vehicle system information, and warning messages. It also shows the shift lever position, the odometer, and the direction the vehicle is driving. Press the menu button until trip fuel information is displayed. Then press the up down arrows to scroll through the following menu items. Note the numbers on the side of the display are folder numbers. Each menu item has a folder number. Your trip 1 and trip 2 odometers show distance traveled and can be reset by pressing the set clear button. Fuel range shows the approximate distance the vehicle can be driven before refueling. This cannot manually be reset. Average fuel economy estimates your vehicle's fuel economy and can be reset by pressing the set clear button. Instantaneous fuel economy. This display shows the current fuel economy and cannot be reset. Average vehicle speed. This display shows the average speed of the vehicle. This value can be reset by pressing the Set Clear button. Timer. Hold Set Clear to reset the timer to zero. Press again to start the timer. Timer is displayed. The display will show the amount of time that has passed since the timer was last reset, not including the time the ignition is off. To stop the timer, press the Set Clear button briefly while the timer is displayed. The digital speedometer shows how fast your vehicle is moving in either kilometers or miles per hour. Navigation is used to display OnStar turn-by-turn -turn guidance. The last display is blank, showing no information. Press the menu button until vehicle information is shown. Press the up-down arrows to scroll through each menu option. Unit. Use the arrow keys to toggle between US and metric. Press set clear to select. Tire pressure shows you approximate air pressure of all four tires. If the warning light comes on, stop as soon as possible and inflate the tires to the recommended pressure shown on the tire loading information label. During cooler conditions, the low tire pressure warning light may briefly appear when the vehicle is first started and then turn off. This may be an early indicator that the tire pressures are getting low and the tires need to be inflated to the proper pressure. Remaining oil life estimates your oil's remaining useful life. This is not an indication of oil level, therefore check the oil level regularly. When the remaining oil life is low, a change engine oil soon message appears. You must reset this feature after each oil change, being careful not to reset it accidentally at any other time. To reset the engine oil life system, press the Set Clear button. The last display is blank, providing no information.